Supreme Court denies bail to Kanimori in the 2G case, directs the DMK leader to approach trial court for relief. Supreme Court examines Delhi Police's midnight crackdown report, issues notice to Ramdev run Bharat Swabhiman Trust, seeking its version on the 4th of June eviction. Seven alleged rape cases in two days in Uttar Pradesh. A woman gang raped for three days in Kanpur. Girl raped and burnt alive in Etta. Death toll in Bihar's mystery fever rises further. 30 deaths reported till now. Chief Minister Nitesh Kumar seeks centre's help. Status quo maintained after 8th meeting of the joint Lokpal panel. Government claims breakthrough. Differences with government persist, says Team Anna. And another CAG headache for centre. Government on back foot over reported offshore oil drilling scam. Oil Minister defence to Damram. A very good evening. You're watching Focus News. I'm Ashwarya Kapoor. In a gruesome incident reported from a village in Haryana's Karnal district, the naked corpse of a dead woman was found in her house. And it was the foul stench emanating from the dead body that led the villagers to discover the body. And crime against women is rising at an alarming rate in Uttar Pradesh, which is ruled by a woman chief minister. Well, it seems that the Mayavati government in Uttar Pradesh cannot ensure protection to women in the state. The incidents of rape and murder and of sexual harassment are being reported at a shocking rate. In the past one week, at least five major incidents of violence against women have been reported. Well, it all began with Lakhimpur, where a 14-year-old girl, Sonam, was allegedly raped and hanged in a police station compound. And in the past 48 hours, four incidents of rape or attempted rape have been reported. In Kanauj, a minor was blinded for resisting rape by two youths. In Basti, another minor was raped at gunpoint. At Etta, a 33-year-old woman was raped and burnt alive. While in Kanauj again, a girl was abducted and gang raped for three days. Now, police have practically been ineffective and the Chief Minister Mayawati does not seem to be paying any attention to such an alarming rise in crime against women. Last week, she had slammed NCW and NHRC for giving what she called undue attention to the crimes being committed in Uttar Pradesh. Crime against women is increasing at an alarming rate in Maya land. The entire state is in a state of shock with the rising crime against women. In yet another appalling incident, a 33-year-old woman was raped and burnt alive in Ita district. <laughs> 